Hey y'all, Rico here. I uh, learned something today, so I wanted to pass it along to you so uh, you don't make the same mistake I made and end up in a bind like I am now. We're working on the 4BT for JK project, and as it turns out, 4Bs and 6Bs come with what they call a fractured connecting rod. When they cast this rod, what they actually will do is cast the rod one piece score this right here and actually break it. You can see the breaks in the rough casting. We had to get a replacement rod for our 4B. When you order a 4B rod, since the fractured rod is now discontinued through Cummins, what you get is the new style for the common rail engines where this is actually machined. It's cut and machined. You can see it nice and smooth. Why does that matter? Well, if you look at the bearing locating notches, you will see that they are offset on the fractured rod. Therefore, the fractured rod takes a different insert for the upper and the lower. On the machined rod, they're the same insert, upper and lower. So, when you order aftermarket rod bearings, like I did, they give you a set for this new style rod. So, bottom line, I'm screwed. I've got four sets of bearings for this rod and only one of this rod. And I have to order some different inserts because this upper will fit both rods, but the lower are different. So, just a little something. Maybe it'll help you out in your project because you know when you find this out, on Saturday when everything's closed. So we're dead in the water until we can get some different rod bearings. Thank you all for watching. I'll catch you later.